advice to the young dudes coming up is uh, probably stay true to the game, stay true to yourself, never get, let your confidence get wavered by what other people think, because people are going to think what they're going to think regardless, and half of them can't even play, so you know what I mean, do what you got to do, everybody that get in front of you, I only speak for receivers, everybody that get in front of you, no matter how bad or how good they say he is, go get your money. You know, um, advice to them young boys, man. Y'all stay with it, man. Uh, get your books. Pay attention to what the teacher's telling you, man. Set yourself up. Five, ten years down the road, man. You can't think about tomorrow, man. You got to enjoy the day, but you got to think. You know, down the road, you know, how it's gonna affect you, how it's gonna affect your family. You know, how everything you do affects somebody close to you. So just stay grounded, stay positive. You know, believe in what you believe in. Always stand for what you stand for. Don't let nobody tell you different. Some advice for the youngsters. I mean, looking back, you know, um, as far as in football, uh, I would have chose to study more film. You know, at an early age, especially in high school, we kind of overlooked the fact that uh, film is important because we're always usually bigger, faster, and better than everybody else in high school. So, um, you know, finding out in college that uh, how beneficial film is and uh, studying your opponent and all that kind of stuff. And also, uh, biggest thing for like young guys, man, just stay in the weight room, especially off season, always work to get stronger, faster, bigger. And also uh, try to encourage some of your teammates to do the same thing. Um, you know, you can always improve, but it's always better when you bring along somebody else, another teammate, so you guys improve together, and then next you know the whole team is getting better together, so. Some advice, the main advice I give y'all, you mean just directing with 100%. Don't slack off, don't be lazy. You know, I know that in college, I was a little bit lazy and it cost me a few games of mine. I mean, but if you're not lazy, you work hard, the coach will love you, and then the scouts will love you. Just keep working hard every day, grind every day. Just stay humble and just keep working. Hard work always pays off at the end. Um, that's all you can do. You know, all you, only thing you've been doing is working to get where you at. In college or in high school, get that starting job or that starting position in college. So you just gotta keep working to get to where you want to be. Oh, you know, Jeff, you're blessed with being an opportunity. The game of football can take you so so far. You meet so many people, so many faces, and so many great people. And I just want to say, you know, put in that extra work, keep grinding, make your family proud, do what's best for you. And I would say for sure, just keep working hard. You know, it's gonna be a grind, but. At the end of the day, you're doing it for a purpose. You know, you're doing it to take care of your family. At the end of the day, you gotta, you gotta have that mindset regardless of what you're doing. You know, extra work is something that you always want to do. You know, you want to get ahead of your opponent. That's something I've always been doing, man. If, if I see people getting extra work, even if I don't see, you know, I'm always going get some extra work regardless if it's just doing push-ups at night. You know, just doing anything to get get ahead. You know. Under the Radar Sports Media, the hottest sports videos in the nation. So